gonna do lower cervical on the left. Got it. Right where the last lumbar meets the sacrum, I'm gonna lift him up and adjust. <laughs> Got it. Sorry, okay. Cal, but that was your bad spot. All right, bud, you're good. That might be the most important one of all. Just walk with him, and you don't have to carry him. And uh, let's go this way. Come on, Cal. Come on. Cal, man, where are you? All right. Come on, bud. Here's another room. Come on, bud. And the yeah, sure. We're waiting for Calvin. So the reason I wanted to use this room, he's getting Calvin, is because this table has no separation in it. It's one big piece. So if I cover it with a towel, and Jeff helps me, we can do a little session with Calvin. Now Calvin has no real problems. I'm still going to look for any misalignments I might see because he's really physical. He likes to do zoomies and he likes to run and jump on couches um, at home. And uh, so, you know, sometimes since he's athletic and takes a lot of risks in his running, um, it's nice to just check to see how his neck is, see how his lower back and pelvis is. And I think we should put a clip of him doing zoomies to show you how physical he is. Sure. So we're gonna put that in as um, a little clip. Cal, go get your football. All right, we've got prisoner 555 here. We're going to the dog park. Okay, so let's put him on here, and you're gonna help me support him. Okay. And, um, oh look, he's doing all the right things. Okay. Don't take collar off. No, we, we could control with that, that would be nice. Okay. Um, hey, Calvin. Thank you, Calvin. Can I work on you right now? What do you think? All right, let's, let's start checking him, okay? So the first thing I wanna check is his range of motion of his neck. So I'm gonna tilt his head up. Oop. There you go. Yep, you can bring look up. We want dogs, especially young dogs, to be able to look all the way up at the ceiling and come all the way back down again. So face the camera, and we're gonna bring your nose down. Here, stand up. Maybe you hold under his chest, and I'm gonna, no, 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 let him be on all fours, but just hold him like this. Okay. Just give a little support. And I'm bringing his head down, good. So you have pretty good range of motion. Then we're gonna turn you all the way to the right, and all the way to the left. And then hold him up front, I'm gonna look at his lower back. So you're gonna just, no, I mean, you're just, again, you think of the chest, okay? So you don't wanna, you wanna let the legs touch. Um, kind of here, let me do it first. So you're just holding under like this, holding under the chest. Okay, good. And that way I can pick his legs up. Here, come around and look at this with the camera. So when I do it in this position, the left leg's coming a little short. So there is a little something off. Do you see that? The white foot is shorter than the black foot. Mm -hmm. Now turn his head all the way that way while I pick up his legs. Okay, so you're gonna hold with the chest and it's the same. So try to bring him the other way now. And that evens it. So he's got a little subluxation on the left side and I'm gonna adjust that. So come around again towards the front of the table. And let me see where it is. So it could be left atlas. His left atlas is a little tight, so I'm gonna, I actually have to stay there, I'm coming around. I'm gonna pull down on the left atlas, I just have to have a good angle. So I'm gonna get this for you. Got it. Then he also has a lower cervical. Hi Calvin, how's that feeling? I'm gonna do lower cervical on the left. Got it. Now let's recheck the legs. So you're gonna hold the chest again, I'm gonna pull the legs up, I'm gonna see if they're even, okay? Ready? 
Not quite there yet, so there's more to do. Um, I'd love to say they're even, but they're not. So I think there's something in his hip also. Okay. So it turns out that this was worth working on because <laughs> he has a couple of things. And, and when people get to see the clips of him doing the zoomie, they'll see how incredibly physical he is. Yeah. You know, he's not a couch potato. No. <laughs> he can be for moments of his right. evening. Yeah. But he loves to run and jump. Yes. And be incredibly uh, acrobatic. So now here I am at the lower lumbars, right where the last lumbar meets the sacrum. I'm going to lift him up and adjust. <laughs> Got it. It was at this moment. Sorry, Kevin, that was your bad spot. All right, bud, you're good. That might be the most important one of all. Got it. Okay, so let's look at the legs again. Hold up the chest, and we're going to just see if we got it. Ready, Cal? One, two, three. Even. Got it. All right, so you're good, Cal. Let me rub your buttocks out. You feel this one, Cal? So I'm on the hip, on the glute. And I'm going to do this one. There's not much of a tail, but I'm going to see how it is. It's good. Because he has his tail docked, right? No, or it's, na it's just natural. Like, it's their natural. Yep. Yeah. Now let's check the front leg. Okay, I'm almost done, Cal. Let's bring that leg forward. Nice. Bring it back. Good job. Let's do this back leg if we can. I'm going to bring that one back. Nice. Check each little toe. It's a little flangy. Check this in good motion. Check the knee. Check the hamstring compared to the quads. They all feel good. Come under and into the iliopsoas, nice and loose. I'm going to come to your side now. And I'm going to check this back leg. The back right quad is healthy. The hamstring is good. His little knee is good. Nice. Some dogs get hyper, hypermobile patellas. His seems intact. I'm going to check the rib cage. Okay, now I'm going to go to the front leg. Again, we go forward with the humerus. Back. Ooh. Sorry, bub. Let's pick this up. Okay. Sorry, bub. Just want to make sure this is not bothering you. I'm going to lift this just a little bit. Got it. Okay, babe, I got you. I got you, okay? You're a good boy. Your shoulder was out. So he had an anterior humerus. And and so things can get misaligned. Mm -hmm. And he's pretty active, like yeah. you said. I mean, he runs around like crazy. Yeah. And... So how do you feel now? What do you think of all that? Think about it before you answer. Hmm? Doing okay? Yeah, that's a good response as a yawn. All right. I think we're done. Let me check the atlas. Atlas is good. Good space between the wings of the atlas and the angle of the mandible. Let's check your little TMJ. Nice. Let's open up and see. Nice. Good. Good. Yeah. And I'm going to massage your face a little bit. Yeah. 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 Look at that. Okay. I wasn't making fun of you. I love you. Okay, you're a good boy. Okay, thanks for coming in today. Is it okay if I work with him? One more time, I couldn't hear you. Oh, okay. So we're going to work with you first. And what are some of your key spots? What do you want to do today? Well, um, I'm always sort of tight throughout my back, particularly like my mid spine. Yeah. And my lower back too, actually a couple days ago, I actually had a hard time putting my socks on, which is a little embarrassing, but mm -hmm. um, I just have pretty bad posture in general, just from sitting at a computer all day. Yeah. You know, I lean forward a lot. I'm trying to correct that, I actually have a stand-up desk now, so I'm trying to be more mindful mm -hmm. of, you know, standing up and 
you know, keeping the posture. But you've I been, just get you've been a hockey player most of your life. I too, have. Right? Yeah. You, you play in adult leagues also. I right? do. Yeah. You know, so you still get out there. I do. I play once a week. <laughs> that's pretty good. That's <laughs> if a, you want to call that. <laughs> that's a tough sport to keep up with. Yeah. Um, I don't know how old you are, but it's a tough sport to keep up with after the age of twenty. It is. And yes. then thirty. Yes. And I don't know where you are. I'm but, over forty. Yes. Okay. Put it that way. But so <laughs> you'll feel it when you're playing hockey in your forties. Yeah, I feel it the next day a lot. Yeah. Let's put it that way. All right. So we're gonna do some good stuff. So we're gonna let him run. Around. I'm going to get you on the table. Okay. We're going to get started, and uh, you're going to lie face down, and um, I'll put your nose right in there. Okay. Okay. Oh, did you take? Oh, let's do a few things first. Let's get your shoes off. Yeah. And your pockets empty. Pockets so are empty. you can put everything up in here. And you guys can here. Come sit. You can spin around. Let's see what we have here. So I have these lockers, and inside the locker is a place to put your key, uh, keys and phones, change. Yeah. So Calvin, empty your pockets. <laughs> he doesn't have pockets, does he? He doesn't. All right, is there anything else? In my watch. I no, you leave that on. Okay. All right, so now get on the table. All right. Lie face down. And you'll put your nose right in the middle. Nice socks. Thanks. And I'm gonna put this around, I'm gonna put this around your ankle and stretch you a little bit and you're going to reach out the far, farthest one that you can get and you see where his hands are everyone so this will give him a nice stretch when we start the machine and make you a little bit taller in the moment here look calvin's just pacing around everybody do you see him over there calvin what are you up to don't you want to watch this calvin you want to watch your your dad get adjusted not really Okay, come back here. So we're gonna do some uh, some good work here. Turn your face to the left. Good, and now turn all the way to the right. Which way is it harder to turn? Uh, pr the, both pretty decent, but I said a little bit harder to the left. Okay, so when you go to the left, go to the left again, and take one finger and point to where you feel tightest in that position. Oh, and he's that. pointing kind of at the lower cervicals, like C5. Head back to center. Now I'm going to hold this spot with my thumb, and now you're going to turn and see if I was on the right spot, okay? Do you think so? Uh, maybe a little lower, actually. Okay, let's start again. How about there? Yeah, it's definitely the spot, no okay, doubt. Okay, so that's okay. actually C6. Okay, it's good that we asked. Good. So I'm just going to warm you up a little bit. I think I need to break out the elbow with this point. Oh, boy. <laughs> So I'm going to start loosening up with the famous elbow. Ooh, oh. do you feel how that, that made you jump, didn't oh, it? Oh yeah, I know. Here, turn your face this way so we can see you talk a little bit. So how many hours did it take you to drive down? Oh, a little over three. Yeah. Not too bad, right? No, not too bad, actually. It didn't hit much traffic, which was good. Do you feel the elbow or not yet? Oh, I feel a little bit, yeah, <laughs> for sure. How about here? Uh-huh. So you get a little tight in the lower back. Yeah. Your thoracic's definitely get tight. Oh, yeah, right there. This one makes you jump. Yeah, I don't even know what spot that is. Ooh, that it, 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 you almost have a reflex to that spot, so when it, he, his body jerks away. Okay. And coming up the back here. And pushing in here. There you go. And I'm coming down again. This is where you jumped last time, so you didn't jump this time. Do you feel? Yeah, and then jump. Yeah, it's so still a little tight, but it's, it's desensitizing a little bit. Where it's, you're not as reflexive. Yeah. At that point where your body involuntarily jumps. Right there. Right. Make you jump again. And yeah. You know why? Because I, I went in pointier with my elbow. Instead of broad contact, I went in sharp. Yeah. And because I'm working that area, I'm trying to see what it's doing. And I think there's a little irritation of a nerve there, and that's why it's jumpy. It hurts a little there too, doesn't it? I would say a little more than a little. <laughs> it hurts a lot, right? Yeah, definitely. Probably like a six or seven. Six or seven. Okay. Come around this side. So let's. Um, Let's work the other side now. Look at Calvin. Me? Swing around. Here comes Calvin. 
that one with you up to? Did you? Do you want me facing this way? This yeah, way. if you want, it's nice. Next time he comes around, you can pet him. Okay. Calvin, come here. He doesn't want to come around. Calvin, come here. It's good to have Calvin. What's going on with me, bud? Calvin, are you going to cross promote with me? Or are you going to put this on your channel? I think that's fair. If I post you on my channel, you've got to post me on your channel. What do you think, Calvin? How does this feel, side feel in comparison? I don't think I jump as much on this left side. No, I'd not, say it's, it's more it's, it's right. It's not as sharp, right? Yeah. I mean, the pressure actually is good. It's like probably what I need. Good. Head back to center. So I'm going to just go a little stronger now. So I lower the table so I can get more leverage. And you can feel that now too, right, Jeff? I can. Good. So the next thing we're going to do, Jeff, is we're going to... Um, Turn off this machine, and I'm going to have you actually come stand up now, okay? And you're going to sit right here. It's a small little stool, and spin this way just on an angle. Is Calvin nearby? Yep. Okay. Turn your head this way and tilt your head down, and come back up again, and turn your head and tilt it down. Your occiput is jammed up, so I'm going to come under here and let your head mold against my chest. Got it. It felt amazing. That made pretty loud. Single click. It was a crack. Yep. Good. I now, it. now come lie on your back, and we're going to do a little Y strap if that's okay. Yeah, it's great. Now we're not going to do Y strap on cow. Okay. Because that's not appropriate. But you'll get one today. How's that sound? Sounds awesome. Okay. So now, this goes behind. And we're going to start with a stretch. So we're not going to do the Y strap pull on the very first rep. We're going to do a few stretches first, okay? Yeah. That way you kind of warm into it. Tilt your head back just a centimeter. And don't help me. So I need your head to just lay down. There you go. Good. Okay. So here's the first stretch. Good. Big breath in and blow it out. Good. Does that feel okay so far? Yeah. So this time we'll do it. So this time I'll stretch, 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 and then pop. Okay? okay? Yeah. Big breath in and blow it out. <clears throat> oh, yeah. What did you notice? So I, I definitely heard a pop in my neck, but I, I felt it probably all the way down to like my, close to my mid, mid back, I would say. Really? Close, yeah, probably like the lower part of the upper back. Okay, good. Yeah. Calvin, come on back. Calvin, come here. Calvin, you want a treat? Treat? He's thinking about it. All right, so now I'm up here at C2, right in there. That's the side that you had the lower cervical on though, right? Yeah. So let's see if we can do that. Drop. Oh, there it goes. That was loud. All right, good. Yeah, that's good. That was good, folks. <laughs> so lie face down. Put your nose right in there. And we're gonna shoot from the top of the table. And see, I don't know if you're going to go this way, but we're going to set it up this way. So big breath in and blow it out. Big breath in and blow it out. No, we've got to do that face up. Okay. So you're going to lie on your back. Just 
you tell this way. I, I had a feeling it was going to be face up, but I tried to do face down because it would be yeah. able to see better on video. So when you played it back, you could see it better. Yeah. But this you'll feel better if I can get it. Okay. And at the end of the day, we got to get it if it's in there. Yeah. So let's see what we can do, okay? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. That was a few. Yeah, yeah. What was snap, it like? Snap, crackle, pop. There was a few pops oh, yeah. there, right? Okay, <laughs> yeah. good. And a couple more. Yep. Good. So now lie on your side this way, facing me. And pull this knee up. And good. Let this roll down. Let the shoulders come back. And look over your shoulder that way. Got it. So come this way. And you heard it pop, right? I did, yeah. I usually can't get that one to yeah. pop. So that one, you're not easy. Okay. So um, whoever works on you back home has their work cut out for, for them because that's not easy to get you yeah. there. You're, you're really tight. On that way too, like my lower back just doesn't pop anymore like it used to. Yeah. When I was younger, it popped so easy. And now I could have people jump on it and they can't get it to crack. Yeah. But we got some there, didn't we? We did. So remember, head that way, shoulders that way, hips come down. That one didn't pop. Okay. Did it? I don't think so. I, don't yeah. think so. I, I mean, I couldn't hear it. I'll, I'll be honest. It didn't yeah. pop. Okay. Okay. So now I'm going to come under this this uh, ankle, and I've mostly got the hip there. Good. And let's come in close. Good. Good. Done. You feel it pop when I slapped it? I felt it, yeah. yeah. And that was this joint in here. Sorry. Ear. Cracked, did I, you hear I it? I did, I heard it. Yeah. It cracked before I even impulsed. Yeah. Got it. Oh yeah. <laughs> so I, I, I here look up at me for a second. I had to do something special for Jeff. So I thought I would give him the ear crack. Now his lower back doesn't crack great. We got some when you were turned this way. Mm -hmm. That way no, but how to do the ear crack. All right. So we did the Y strap. We did some ear cracks. Yeah. I got an occiput lift on you. Um, we got the lower back to crack on one side, which you think is pretty good because normally it doesn't go. Right. We got a lot of your thoracics, which is your favorite area. Yep. And we got some extra neck stuff too. So it's good. Yeah. I got your thumbs to go. Let's take care of Calvin now. All right. Okay, so come sit up and then stand this way. And stand up and let us know how you're feeling. Super loose, yeah. I mean, a lot looser than I was. I feel like I'm so tightly wound that particularly in the mid back area. So it's just, you know, helpful to get that to release so I can, you know, function a little better for sure. Okay. Thanks for having us. What do you think of all that, Calvin? Do you want people to leave comments? You don't really care about my channel, but maybe they'll come to your channel and subscribe, right? We love that. I hope, we appreciate that. I hope you guys, yeah. if you like Calvin, go to his channel, subscribe, Watch one or two of his videos to see what he, his work is, and um, become a fan of Calvin. All right, let's put him on the floor, and let's see if he wants to shake out or move around a little bit. We're going to follow him out into this. Right here is good. Don't let him go out. You lift, and don't touch him so he has a chance to figure out what he wants to do. Hi, Calvin. It's me. Thanks for watching, everyone. 
And thanks, Jeff, for coming down. Doc, thank All you right. so much. Appreciate having us. Appreciate it.